Y'all, this man just left me here because I didn't want to have sex with him. Because I didn't want to give him no So he left me outside. Like, what the fuck? I'm literally outside waiting for this other man to come pick me up. Like, one thing about it, don't play with me because now I'm going to. Finding a woman that's not like a modern woman is like finding a needle in a haystack. That's how it is. You may be a modern woman watching this video, or you may be a guy watching this video. Think to yourself, or thinking to yourself, where did we go wrong? Well, you know what? In this video, we're going to talk about it. <laughs> What's up everyone and welcome to another video don't forget to hit that like button on your way in smash that subscribe button hit that notification bell that will let you know when i upload content you know what we're gonna do before we get into anything let's roll that clip i just want to let y'all know be toxic for the rest of your 20s you only get one life huh Live your toxic 20s. You never get to be 20 years old, 21, 22, 23, 24, none of that ever again in your life. Be toxic, because don't get in your 30s thinking you could just go slashing ties and doing all this crazy shit. You too old for that now. You what? You too mature. Be toxic for the rest of your 20s. And if you delusional, turn that shit up a notch. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your 20s. <laughs> you only get to do this shit one time. You see, this is some of the worst advice that you could ever give a woman. Why would you encourage a woman to be toxic? This is what we're talking about. Modern women teaching other modern women how to be modern women. You need to be toxic. Be 20 and 25 and 26 because when you get in your 30s then you want to mature this is the reason why you need to prioritize getting a man when you are in your 20s because after you get 30 40 50 and beyond it's a lot harder to get a man most of you that wait may or may not get a man and a lot of people may say, well, you're generalizing, you're stereotyping. Go talk to women that are 30 plus and talk to them about how miserable they are. I'm sitting here and I can help it but think that I'm tired of working. I have always worked through my pregnancies, through everything, always paid the majority of the bills. Now I'm like, I don't want to be this strong, independent woman. I, I, I don't, I don't. I am not interested. I have a huge, huge house. I pay all the bills by myself. Now I just want the universe to bring me the man that can make me a housewife. I've done it and I'm not interested anymore. I want to be a housewife. I want to have your dinner ready when you get home. I want to take your shoes up, give you a massage when you get home. I want somebody to push me back to the 70s. I am not interested in this. I don't want to work anymore. I want to be a housewife. So universe, Send me that boss man. Talk to women who did not prioritize getting a man when they were younger. Now that they are old, they cannot get a man. And see, this is the reason why over here we hold women and men accountable. But in society, society holds men and women accountable for different things. In our society that we live in, Women are not held accountable at all. Men are held accountable for everything. Men are being blamed for everything and women take accountability for nothing. You would be hard 
press to see a woman take accountability. Now, I'm not saying they don't. I'm not saying that a woman can't take accountability because they can, but will they? Nope. Will they take accountability? Nope. Fellas, leave a comment if you've ever seen a woman take accountability. That comment section about to be dry AF. Modern women are entitled. Modern men, we don't want modern women. I know women watch. I know there's women watching. Whether they make a comment or like the video or they just watch and not comment, not like the video. I know you're watching and I want you to listen. I want you to come here. Come here, ladies. It's time to start taking accountability. We don't want to date women that wear wigs. We don't want to date a woman that wears fake eyelashes. We don't want to date a woman who doesn't have home training. We don't want to date a woman who wants us to be six feet, six fingers. But you drive a beat up Honda and live in the projects. We do not want modern women. We want women that have sense. So if you're a woman out there and you have some sense and you came across this video, leave a comment and let us know that there are women out there that still make sense. Because I have faith that there are women that are still out in the world that make sense. They're either married, at home, taking care of their kids, living their best life, and they're not on the internet with everybody else. Leave a comment, like the video, join the discussion. Because trust and believe, men, we're looking for that. We want that. We want that. We need that. We need feminine women. We need women that don't come with baggage. We need women that know how to have home training. We need women that are different than what everybody else is on the dating market. Finding a woman that's not like a modern woman is like finding a needle in a haystack. That's how it is. But anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tickle that notification bell. That will let you know when I upload a new video. And until the next video, peace.